Get, get, gotcha! Why, cat? Honey, oh fucking god! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you? She could. She, 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 she just. Oh, 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 fuck! Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. This is really different so far. I used to have a better relationship with Kenny. Now it's just shit. At least I thought I did. You want to talk? Uh-uh. You uh, understand what happened? Yes. Chuck said. What Chuck said? That what happened to Doc would happen to me. The fuck he did. I swear. Sorry. I want to talk some sense into it. Don't be mad. God damn it, Chuck. Hey, how you doing? Say it to me, asshole. What you said to my girl. Excuse me, son. Telling the little girl she's gonna die. Wanna scare people, scare me. Fucker. Okie dokie. She's gonna die. Son of a bitch. How was that? How about I throw your sorry ass off this fucking train? Now we're both scared. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I'll tell you. As long as you don't toss me over the rail. I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not a barber. It ain't gotta be styled, Jesus. You gotta run around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. 
find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work and not to be afraid. I don't need to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plant, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. But it's something. <sighs> You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. I'm sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. Got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. Shut the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Uh, He's safe up here. You betcha. Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. Still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. Hey. Yeah? I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you, so forget it. Okay. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. What happens if I get by here for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? Many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Hmm. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah. Guess not. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. See you. Yeah. The door to the boxcar. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not going to let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, let will figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. What a crappy day. The crappiest. If three months ago, I'd known what you'd be seeing. I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You're damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got 
right. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. But I found that if I did that, it's a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Bit to the right. a little higher. I got it! Excellent. Good shot. go nice I did it yeah you did good job I was holding my breath and the gun didn't shake so much see you did good they're not walkers though no far from it but you know how these things work now We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. There's some scissors in Chuck's pack. They look clean enough. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. Okay. You know, we don't have to do this right away. Okay, good. Uh Hey, Clint. Hi. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. <sighs> you have to do this now. Do you know how to do this? Nope. No idea. I'm not much of a stylist, you know. I'm going to look like a boy. But think how much safer you'll be. I'd 
would rather be dead. Just now. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. It does, Clam. Killing is bad no matter what. Why do you do it now to protect yourself? And to protect me? It doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Chuck has some booze left. It's a fifth of whiskey. I hope we're not on this train much longer. I can head out towards the camp. I can't. No. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Sure. Known for its finish. No kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. <sighs> Check wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. Yeah. See you. Yeah. Uh. Oh, yeah. It's going to go back to Clementine with a map. <coughs> it was me. I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. I know, Ben. What for? Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. 
by the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me. Kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? Yeah, I do. I'm real sorry. Let's drop it for now, okay? What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. <sighs> Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We need to help find a boat. It's our best bet at safety. Okay, but we'll be in Savannah, and my parents were in Savannah. I know. Look. No, I don't care about safety. I care about finding them. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. We're gonna wanna look for a boat here, I imagine. And from there, we've got all the Savannah to the southwest of us. And we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh, hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. A lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty dessert. It's called the M... M... something... Mar. Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I tell my parents? You know... Sure. feel good better i'm glad we have a plan and you're a good little chef thanks i guess we should see how far oh shit hold on everybody <laughs> That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm. I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. A thing that's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. There's a crew here. This ain't shit. This? Yo! If you keep screaming like that, you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could've just kept walking. No, we're friendly! Put your hand down, kid. That's what everybody says. We know. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah, you're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. 
Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. We'll be down here. All right. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. Huh. A group of guys is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now. What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista, what's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Hey, I'm not gonna bullshit you. Our group is a little fucked right now. We had a bite victim, then his mom took her life, and before that, just... It's okay. Oh, shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Well, this is great. See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I, uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? Kenny lost his wife and kid. Man, how long ago? What time is it? Uh, I don't know, uh, four? Maybe two hours ago. God damn. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. <coughs> it's awesome, though. That tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. All right. Folks probably had their way with that van a while ago. Huh. That's about the only useful thing in here. It's empty. Cabin. This thing is mangled to hell. No releasing it. No nothing. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Let's go talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? Am I gonna have to tell your people the plan or what? All right. 